What is up you guys Alpha Male here we're back again with another Castle Clash video and in today's video you guys we have to talk about one of the best updates that has ever been brought on to Castle Clash and I'm super excited to talk to you all about it so let's get right into it let's go! <laughs> Okay, you guys, so what's going on is that we got this huge update. Obviously, we got to get a new hero, right? Let me just talk to you guys about the new hero real quick. The new hero that we are getting is Trixie Treat. Now, this new hero, the skill is Dirty Tricks. It deals 100% attack damage to five random targets and removes their buffs. And also summons two level 20 pumpkins for 15 seconds. The so cooldown is 10 seconds. Hero has a level 8 war god. Dope looking hero. Here's what she looks like evolved. What more would you want from a Halloween hero? I wouldn't know what you would want because this is their new Halloween hero. And obviously, uh, we give Vlad Dracula, Pumpkin Duke, all these different heroes. But this is the new one, and I think she is pretty cool. I'm not going to lie. I think she's pretty cool. Now, the reason why I got over her pretty quickly is we got to talk about the best update I personally think has ever been inputted into Castle Clash by IGG ever, period, dot, slash, whatever you want to do. Check this shit out. As you guys can see right here, I got an executioner. And my executioner, it, it kind of has something floating next to it. You guys, we have, I get chills even thinking about it. We have a new pet system into this game. Let me show you what's going on over here. We got a pet plaza over here. And this pet plaza, what you'd be able to do is it's going to show you whole different uh, pets and stuff like that that you can have with your heroes. Now, if you guys take a look over here, I have an executioner, right? Of course I do. You guys saw my executioner already. Now, my hero, I mean, not my hero, my pet, Doom Balloon, level 1 Doom Balloon, deals 200% pet attack damage to a maximum of 5 nearby enemies, uh, enemy buildings every 6 seconds, also increases the damage they take by 10% for 3 seconds. This pet is going to be doing so much for me, I'm super, super excited to be working with this pet now. I, I love this update so much, you guys. So we have a we have a Doom Balloon. You guys check this out. I didn't even show you the best heroes yet, okay? I did not, I, I, I'm, I'm sorry, I keep saying heroes. I keep forgetting this game. It's, this game's all about pets now. There's no such thing as heroes, okay? Let me show you guys these two pets. Oh my God, dude, I'm super, super excited about this. Basically what you have over here is like a unicorn Pegasus type thing. Which is really, really cool. Who does not like a unicorn or a pegasus at the end of the day? I am all chills. I'm telling you. I'm getting legit chills right now making this video. I'm getting goosebumps and shit. Check this out. Has a 56% chance to deal 320% pet attack damage to a nearby enemy hero when its heroes attacks. When its hero attacks. Also removes the targets, buffs, cooldown is 5 seconds. Oh my god, dude. This is going to be the best thing ever. This is completely changing Castle Clash for the better. 100%, 360 around. This is going to change the game in the most positive way. Check this. This this one right here. I can't even look at the screen when I'm talking about this pet. This thing gives me so much chills right now. And it's just... We got a bublo. A bublo. What is a bublo? It's a fish. We got a pet fish now our pet fish that is in it's, it's in like a little bubble so obviously it's a fish it needs to have some whatever you know it doesn't matter this is bublo bublo has a pet skill restores the hp of three allied heroes with the lowest hp by 240 percent the pet attack uh every 5.5 seconds also increases their movement speed by 20 percent for two seconds you guys i am super excited about this update and i hope you guys are super excited about this update as well it will happen in the near future and i have to tell you guys from the bottom of my heart this update is a hundred percent trash this is a hundred percent trash this has to be the worst update i have ever seen in my life i've been around this game ever since uh sans 7 has been around this game so me and him played a lot together we talked a lot together you know we played since the game was basically out right so we've been through all the updates, obviously some updates you like and some updates you don't like. But this is icing on the cake for the reason why, you guys always ask me, Alpha, how come you don't make Castle Clash videos anymore? It's been four or five days since you made one, what's going on? Let me tell you what's going on. Shit like this is what's going on, okay? Shit like this is making me not want to play this game anymore. Shit like this is making me change the way I feel about the whole aspect of this game and obviously if i don't like what i play i really don't want to post it and i won't post it so this is a huge issue that's going on right now 
Now there's tons more things that I can talk about with it. Um, one thing is I, I don't like how every YouTuber is, well first before I even get into that, this is what went, this is what went down you guys. Castle Clash obviously, uh, obviously will talk to you know YouTubers and stuff like that. Um, they'll, they'll talk to them and they'll be like, hey you guys, I want you to go on our test servers and I want you guys to you know just try this out and do streams and stuff like that and videos of this new update and I want you guys to, uh, you know, just basically just give us some feedback. What do you guys think? Now, people have been asking me, Alpha, we've seen all these other big YouTuber, Castle Clash YouTubers, you know, do this update and you haven't yet. What's up with that? I'm going to answer that for you guys in this video. And the reason why I have not made a video about it is because of how bad it is. Now, I was thinking, am I just going to make a video and just pretend that I like it? That's what I did in the beginning of this video. I was showing you guys what it looks like to pretend that you like something. It, it, it's not that hard to pretend. I hate this with every ounce of my heart. It's that bad. It, it's fucking absolute trash. You need the biggest fucking hefty bag to put over this update and close it and throw it down a mountain and don't look back at it. Make sure that shit's dead. Just throw it away. It's that bad. I don't know what the hell's going on with IGG. I don't know what they drink. I, I don't know. I don't know. They're drinking something that's tripping them out. I, I want to know what it is because that shit is probably lit. Just kidding. I'll, I'm just making an example here. What's really bothering me as well is a lot of these YouTubers are making videos about this, all these big YouTubers. And, and let me just give you a couple examples. You see stuff like this. Now, let's go ahead and go into this this pet plaza, all right? Now, of course, this is where you're going to get all of your all of your pets. And here we go. I've gotten some. I, I had to uh, play around with it. So we, they got some different names as well. This one's called Draco. Then we got Phoenix. I you get it, Phoenix. But fi anyway, AVR, Doom Balloon. Like that just sounds like something's gonna happen. And Bub Bublo. Now those are the ones that I currently have. Um, as you guys might already know, all of these pets have different skills. So, you will have to uh, be pretty strategic on who you place on who because they do have different things. Like this one, you know, has a 40% chance to deal damage to a random nearby enemy hero and targets around it when its hero attacks. Also reduces energy and that actually goes up at this as this skill goes up. So, yeah, a pet that reduces energy, that's going to be pretty deadly. So you get examples like that, and you also, if, I mean, he was talking about, you know, um, this new, this new dragon hero, right? He was talking about this new, this new dragon pet, whatever the fuck it is, right? So look at this other YouTuber trying to show this dragon pet doing his moves. Take a look at this. Let's see what uh, Draco actually does. So here we go. Let's just put him out. Let's just hope that. Cupid survives this. Okay, Draco, you gotta be closer if you wanna proc. Why don't you proc? I have seen you proc a ton of times. Why don't you proc now? Okay, this is just... Draco, why in the world are you not procing? Are you proccing but doing it invisible? Stop doing that. Please show us. <laughs> I honestly have seen it a ton of times. I have no idea why he is not proccing. That's literally as weird. Why in the world are you not proccing? Draco, please, proc, you do something. Why are you standing there? Or flying, or whatever you want to call it. Now, do you want to know why that pet was just flying there, standing there, whatever? It's because it's trash. It is literal trash. It's just, I, I don't know how else to put it. It is so bad. This is the worst idea I've ever seen in my life. I don't know why everyone is trying to hype this up. You can try to hype this up as much as you want. In my belief, I do not think this is a cool update. So, what I want to bring to this video is showing you guys, I don't think I'm the only one that does not like this. I can. I actually went on those videos from those YouTubers, and I actually grabbed comments. Now, let me show you guys some of the comments I saw on their videos. I'm going to put it on the screen. You guys read, you know, are you guys reading these warming comments right now? Do you feel the positivity in the air? I do. I feel so much positivity, in fact, that I feel inspired. I feel so inspired, in fact, that I can feel the energy spewing through my computer for me to play, for me to play Castle Clash right now. 
obviously I'm kidding. These people are basically with me. They're basically saying what I'm saying. Now, obviously, you guys as viewers, you really do speak your mind in the comment section. So I do respect you guys for that because you guys will put whatever is on your mind in the comment section. And that is an absolute fact. Um, but I don't know why not a lot of YouTubers were talking about how bad this was. A lot of, Like I said, a lot of them were saying, you know, let's just give it a shot. Or, you know, maybe it's bad. Maybe it's not my favorite. But you know what? I'm a YouTuber for this game, so I'm just going to go ahead and go with it and try to level up and blah, blah, blah. And all that. That's not me, you guys. If I don't like something and I know it's a bad idea, I'm just not going to do it at the end of the day. So a lot of people have also been asking me, you know what? So uh, what, what's going on with you and Castle Clash? Are you going to make videos anymore about it? I am going to still make videos of Castle Clash. Obviously, I still have some type of love for this game. I'm just going to make videos on what I want to in this game. So if there's something you guys don't like of the video, it's going to be Castle Clash. But I'm going to make a video of what I want to do in Castle Clash. So hopefully... You guys understand that I'm not gonna I'm not gonna participate in whatever the fuck this is over here. Okay, I'm not participating in this, you guys. No matter how much you beg or plead, I will not participate in this pet shit. Okay, I'm gonna play the game the way I want to play the game, and I will make videos on it. Now, am I gonna make a video every single day like I used to? No. Am I gonna make it maybe every other day, every two days, every week? I don't know. I'm gonna figure out what I'm gonna do, but I am still gonna make Castle Crush videos, you guys. I'm not quitting nothing like that. But I'm gonna do it on what I want it to be. Just trying to put that out there. Now, the thing is, though, I made Castle Clutch videos for three weeks straight. Three weeks straight. And um, in those three weeks, I was really taking a good look of what was going on. I really wanted to see, is Castle Clutch the way to go? And I was taking a good look at it. And in those three weeks, my views were actually a little bit below average. My subscribers were literally at the same thing. I literally dropped five subscribers one day. And then the next day, I gained five subscribers. The next day I dropped seven, I gained seven. I literally stayed at the same thing. I didn't move anywhere. And that was for like three weeks straight. Um, but then I the last couple of days I was doing a lot of different videos, like Gears of War 4, Battlefield 1, and all this stuff. And uh it basically completely changed. I did videos like this. Motherfucker, I swear to god, your your fucking testicles. <gasps> Oh my god, that was the dumbest shit I have ever done in my life. And it completely changed. Like, even though, obviously, I got a lot less views than I would get on a Castle Clash video. But these videos, the like to dislike ratio was higher than my uh, my uh, Castle Clash videos. And um, they were just, I was actually getting subscribers. I was getting subscribers from these videos. A lot of people were telling me, wow, it's a good, I've been getting comments saying, you know, wow, it's a good thing that you switched up from uh, Castle Clash. It feels good to change every once in a while. Oh, I really like these videos, stuff like that. It, I've been getting a lot of good feedback from videos like that. So I'm going to continue doing videos like that. I'm going to continue on doing skits. I got a lot of plans in the future, you guys. I'm still going to play Castle Clash, but I needed to get this off of my mind. Basically, IGG, what the fuck are you doing right now? What are you doing? I have no clue what you're doing. You got to fix your shit. Um, but like I told you guys, I like keeping it always honest with you guys. I want to be straight up and I just want to tell you how I think about this update and why I didn't make a video about it and what the plans are for me in the future of this channel. My goal is to get 100,000 subscribers and um, I'm going to achieve that sooner or later. Okay, if it's 10 years down the road, I don't care. I'm going to continue doing what I'm doing. I'll never quit what I'm doing. This is what I want to do and I'm going to continue on doing it. Now I still do. I, I tell you guys all the time. I still have a full time job. Full time job, okay? Full time. But I still find ways to make a video every day or every other day or every two. I still try to find a way to make really nice videos for you guys. But regardless from that, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys got something out of it. I just want you guys to know where I am and where I stand with this game. I just wanted a little bit more of a serious video just to really put everything together and let you guys really understand what's going on with me and the game and what I want to do and what's going on with just this whole shit. Like, what the fuck, dude? Really? Really? A fish, a unicorn, and a dragon. We have enough dragons in this game. Stop it. Get some help. Yo, you guys seen that vibe? I, I know some of you guys seen that vibe. Some show. I was trying to do something, okay, man. I gotta try to switch up the mood. I probably made a lot of people depressed and shit like that, dude. But for real, what the fuck are you doing, dude? We got dragons as troops as well. Like, what's going on here? Like, it's just stupid. I don't know, man. This is just fucking trash. I'm not gonna be taking part in any of that shit. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, do not forget to like and subscribe. It means a lot to me. 
And hopefully you guys, uh, hopefully some of you guys are with me and thinking this is trash. I don't know, and maybe I'm just crazy or not, but if you guys agree with me, go ahead and leave a like on this video. Subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys all in the next video. Bye, and have an extremely nice day, you guys.